Hey guys, it's Shani and I'm back today with another plan with me and for this week's spread I'm using this kit from my shop. This was called Celebrate. It's no longer available. This actually came out almost a year ago. Um, this was released on Boxing Day of 2018 which was December 26th which is also my birthday. So I did this like birthday kit and I think there were like a bunch of extras and stuff. I don't even remember what the extras were. Um, if I had any like left over, I probably already like put them into my collection and didn't keep it specifically with this kit. So um, yeah, I just, I loved this kit. I loved the colors um, and I loved like the celebratory vibe of it. This was the week of mine and my boyfriend's anniversary. So I really wanted to use kind of like a celebratory kit and that's exactly what I did with that. Um, we did like celebrate our anniversary the weekend before this week. So there wasn't too much celebrating going on, but it was still the, the actual week of. So still wanted to use something cute and pretty. Um, oops, just shook my whole table. <laughs> so I started off by putting down these day covers. These, I believe, are from Paper Crown Planner, I want to say. And I used the date dots from the kit. I had, like, the correct days that I needed, um, so I just used those. And then for my glitter headers, they were just ones that came with the kit. I actually went ahead and put on the glitter header overlays um, before I started filming. I don't even remember why. I thought this might be like an easier way to do it. It was a little bit annoying because like if I didn't put it on perfectly, like it's stuck to the header underneath. So I don't know if I'll continue to do that, but I mean, it made you guys not have to watch me put headers on twice, <laughs> like just glitter headers and then the overlays that go on top of it. So who knows? Maybe it's a good thing. Maybe I will do it again. We shall see. Um, and then once I finished that, I went ahead and wanted to put down my weekend banner, which just says Hello Weekend. And I wanted to use some deco from the kit to like layer behind it because I think that looks really pretty. Um, I love weekend banners in general, so even if there's no deco that I can layer behind it, I still like putting them down. But when there's like deco, I think it adds like an extra little something and always looks super cute. So I just used this like champagne glass and a mimosa looking drink. Um, like layered on top of one another and then put the hello weekend banner on top of that and then i moved on to my sidebar i used the ombre heart checklist in the sidebar as well as a to-do header i was actually talking i think it was in my last video about how they're no longer checklists they're now or sorry they're no longer heart checklists they're now bow checklists but in this format they were still hearts so i can still say ombre heart checklist <laughs> And then on top of the to-do header, I used a habit tracker from the kit, and then I used this last, like, little label-looking thing, which was from where I got the, like, date covers. There was just, like, since there's only seven days, there's, like, enough for, like, eight boxes there, so there's always just, like, an extra label. And I think it looks cute to make it look like it's, like, all very cohesive by putting it at the top where a date cover, like, would go. And I used the last piece of deco from the kit on top of that and marked that it was our anniversary. I do end up moving that deco and switching that out afterwards because I wanted to use it for something else. But um, I end up just putting some balloons over there. But I think both look super cute. Okay, so starting on Monday, the first thing I wanted to mark was that it was our anniversary, obviously. How many times can I say that in this video already? Um, but yeah, I used a third box from the kit as well as a kissing couple Ava sticker from my shop. And then underneath that, I used a like meal icon from the kit. I just grabbed some lunch and coffee with like some of the, some of my classmates, like new friends. Um, and yeah, we'd only met for like two days the previous week, but in my current program, like you kind of have like one class and you have all your classes with them. So it's kind of like high school. So yeah, I really wanted to meet some people and kind of, you know, get to know them. So we did that. And then I placed an Amazon order this day. So I used a label from the kit as well as a money bag icon. And then at the bottom of the day, I used a little thing from the kit to mark down that Yanni came over. I think from Amazon, I mentioned that I like uh, placed an order for some stuff that I needed like for nursing. I think they like told us what we needed in our lab that day because that was like the first Monday that we were there and my labs are on Monday. So they were like, you need a stethoscope, you need a nurse's watch, you need scrubs, you need this, you need that, you need white shoes. <laughs> So many things. Um, so I placed the order on Amazon for whatever I could get there. 
And then on Tuesday, it was payday, so I layered a payday, uh, sorry, script. I wanted to say sticker and script at the same time, and I was like, uh, what? <laughs> but yeah, payday sticker from my shop on top of some washi from the kit. And then I also did do a bunch of designing this day since I don't have class on Tuesdays or Fridays, which is awesome. Um, so I used an Ava on her laptop for that. And then my parents came home this day, so I used a like coming down plain icon from my shop for that. And then I started studying this day, so I used another label from the kit with these really cute glasses stickers. I used to love these kinds of glasses stickers. Like I used to use them for everything school related. I don't use them as much anymore and they're actually like not in the current format of my kits, but yeah, like I love it. I don't know. It's just bring it just brings back like when I just started planning. So I think that's super cute. And then there I go undoing that sticker that I put in the sidebar originally. And I did have to do, I did have to use undo since when I released this kit, I only made it available in premium matte and premium matte, like you can't really peel up stickers unless it like removes ink or whatever. And I didn't really want to deal with that. So just pulled out the good old undo, which yeah, if you guys don't use undo, you totally need it. It's like, I don't know, maybe 15 bucks. I can't really remember. Um, but I always like get mine at Michael's and I think you can use like a coupon on it. So you get like 40 or 50% off. So it's literally a gem and makes removing stickers so easy. So like I said, I moved that cake sticker because my uncle actually ended up bringing over some pie. And I thought like that cake sticker was more appropriate than anything else that I could put. <laughs> and you can't really see the balloon stickers that I put in the sidebar, but they are there. I promise. <laughs> and then I put down a camera sticker with a little foiled bow on top of it from my shop to mark down that I was doing some filming and editing. I also had an anatomy and physiology quiz that was either due or I was doing it. <laughs> so I used a laptop from the kit layered on top of a hexagon for that. And then in the evening, I marked down that I was just reading and I wrote that I was reading the book called What Alice Forgot, which I really liked actually. It's like very young adult, very like don't have to think too much kind of book. So I like that. <laughs> um, and then on Thursday, I marked down that I was doing some printing and cutting in the morning. I used a label from the kit as well as an Ava like at her desk working sticker. Then I marked down that I was doing some more reading, but this time I used a foiled book sticker from my shop and I layered it on top of a little like circle sticker to bring in some color. And then um, I put a label down and I ended up putting like a heart on top of it to mark down some family time. And then I also marked down that I was really low on gas, so I had to go get gas <laughs> after class. Look at all my rhyming. <laughs> and yeah, I think like I said, that heart and the car sticker are both... Um, from the kit. And then I'm filling everything out. <laughs> Let's go. Let's write a little bit faster. And um, okay, so on Friday, uh, the first thing that I marked down was that I had the Planner Friends sale that day. So I used an Etsy icon from the kit for that, like a little circle icon. And then, like I said, we had to buy a bunch of scrubs, sorry, a bunch of stuff for our like clinical and our lab, things like that. So I had to buy scrubs. Um, and I used a label from the kit as well as a shopping bag icon also from the kit. And then um, let's see what I do next. Yes. Okay. So uh, after I went to buy my scrubs, I went to like this store that was like really hard to find. It was like really weird. It was so close to my house, but it was so hard to find because there were like a million and one turns and my GPS was like, you have arrived. And I was like, I don't see the store anywhere. But anyways, after that, I went to the dollar store to pick up some notebooks. So I used a shopping cart circle icon from the kit layered on top of a flag. And then when I got home, I was so tired, so I did take a long nap, and I used a sleeping Ava from my shop for that. I think those are absolutely adorable. I feel like from up here, you can't really see. She just kind of looks like a floating head, but it's because she's using white sheets and a white pillowcase, so <laughs> there's that. And then Sunday, I wanted to mark down that I got my Revlon hair dryer. I guess I actually also ordered that on Amazon on Monday, but I did get that in the mail and I have been loving it, you guys. It's so good. I can get my hair from like wet to dry in like 10 minutes, which is so freaking bomb. 
because before I would literally have to wait hours for it to dry and I hated just blow drying it for some reason but using this tool makes it kind of fun and then I used an exclamation point to mark down that I was doing some more studying and I also used a yoga Ava to mark down that I was doing some yoga and then Sunday I had a work so I just used a piece of washi and layered on top of that a work script from my shop and then after work, I went to Regina's house and we got some Starbucks and placed a bunch of orders. So yeah, um, and then I think I added a bunch of these like little hearts to different places and as well as some little bows to different icons um, just to kind of make the foiling a little bit more consistent and like spread out throughout the entire spread and not just like, I don't know, in specific areas. Um, I like to disperse my foil if I can. That's why I really like glitter header overlays because I feel like it disperses it well. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. Leave this a like if you did enjoy it. That really helps my videos, helps with the YouTube algorithm. Not that I know too much about it, but I've always heard that, so I believe it. <laughs> but yeah, I will see you guys in my next plan with me. Bye!